Hey everyone and welcome to the Sailor Moon Roundup. Last week I said the Sailor Moon short film was going to premiere but I made a bit of a mistake and it turned out it was just a trailer for the short film. Still, even though it was a trailer, it looked very very promising with some great money shots like the transformation and Sailor Moon's tiara throw. Make sure to check out the trailer and stay tuned for the full short film which will be premiering later this month. Another Sailor Moon fan film to keep your eye on is Sailor Moon the Movie. This fan film, which is geared more towards fans of the English version of the anime, is due for release very very soon. Make sure to check out their YouTube channel for more clips from the film and stay tuned, it looks really amazing. If you're not a fan of SMA's Sailor Moon Reimagining or Sailor Moon the Movie's anime look, why don't you check out this brand new fan film from Dark Moon Entertainment. It's set sometime after the end of the manga and looks absolutely beautiful. It's been in production for a while now, but definitely looks worth the wait. In other news, Samantha Bee's been asked about playing Sailor Moon in a stage production. She doesn't seem to be a big fan of the Sailor Moon anime, though honestly if I was a professional actress or entertainer and I performed on stage in maybe a shopping mall as a character, I wouldn't exactly put that on my resume either. Some cool news came out this morning for those who are fans of the new Sailor Moon t-shirts. A fan actually found two brand new ones that right now aren't for sale yet online, but stay tuned, I'm sure they will be. The biggest Sailor Moon news this week though would have to be the release of the new manga for Sailor V2 and Sailor Moon 2. Several issues with this release have caused a lot of conflict within the fan community. Let me know what you think if you've gotten your copies. Do you like the translation? Do you not like it? Do you have any issues with it? Comment down below and let me know what you think. You can also come over to the MoonKitty.net Facebook page and join in the discussions here about the new manga and other Sailor Moon news. It's a great place to connect with other Sailor Moon fans and myself, and really good place to ask questions about any news mentioned in this video. You can also follow my account on Twitter which I update daily with all the Sailor Moon news that comes my way. Thanks so much for watching, and make sure you stay tuned for my video reviews of the Sailor Moon manga and Sailor V manga.